Hey besties, it's Liv. Welcome back to another video. Today I have a special one for you guys because I'm getting married. Aww. In two months. <laughs> um, anyways guys, I'm getting married in two months. So in honor of that, I'm going to be reacting to the biggest wedding fails that I could possibly scour the internet and find. And guys, they say that a certain percentage of marriages end up in divorce. It has to be because of these videos. They're bad. Let's get right into it, guys. Okay, besties, let's get into this first video. This is why the alcohol at my wedding will be very minimal, but also no amount of alcohol in the world could make you do something like that at somebody's wedding. What is going through your teeny tiny tiny little brain? Oh, and also at the end of the video, they don't show it and I'm not going to show it. He gets, he gets clobbered. He gets, you know, he gets punched in the face, rightfully so. Because I would also, I, me and my husband would be tag teaming whoever did that at our wedding. Are you crazy? First of all, the cake, don't even get me started on the prices of cakes. I'm getting a $20 cake from Publix, you're crazy. Uh-uh. The price of cakes can go anywhere from $300 to thousands of dollars. And you're gonna sit up there and sm- No. No, no. Let's rate these videos. I'm gonna rate this one a good six out of 10. All right, let's move on to the next one. That is like the worst possible outcome that could happen at your wedding. Oh my God. Not saying that cheating is any way, shape, or form okay, but you had to do it at the wedding? You couldn't do it any other time at the wedding? Oh my god. Honestly, it's a blessing in disguise because now you know that that man is not the one for you, but that is so traumatic. Oh my god, poor baby. I just want to give her a hug. Could you imagine if that was you in that situation? That is so awful. Oh my god. But booty naked and all in the back of the limo. What was his thought process? He was like, I'm gonna go cheat on her in the back of the limo and she's definitely not gonna find me. Like I am so sneaky and conniving, I can get away with this. Are you dumb? You're glued to each other like this the whole day. And if you're not and you're separated, it's because somebody stops you for like a second and you talk to them, but like you're glued to, she's gonna wonder where you are. Hell is hot and you're going to get your karma. Poor baby, oh my God, that one is a 10 out of 10. On a scale of how bad it is, that's 10 out of 10. On to the next one, my God. <laughs> you come to the wedding, cosplaying Minnie Mouse, and one of your mouse tools is deciding that you're going to cut the cake for them that's crazy that's crazy are you a nurse i'm getting very nursey vibes from you if you know you know what's the phrase not all nurses are mean girls but all mean girls are nurses you get what i'm saying anyways what possessed you to go up there and do that you can't wait Oh my God, I hope it is staged. But what does it say? It says, ignoring the brownie table and confidently cutting myself a slice of her wedding cake, thinking, uh-oh, they forgot to serve it to everyone else. Huh? I'm sorry, but I feel like in order to be invited to a wedding, you have to get your IQ checked. Cause how do you not know? This one I'm going to rate, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. It pissed me off. <laughs> On to the next one. Down. Let's calm down. 
You're not going to ruin my You dish. are not, because the okay. set has flaws. Wow. <laughs> Everybody has flaws, and that's why I love them. You can leave, yeah. Judy. Like, you don't have flaws. You can leave. You <laughs> can get out of my wedding now. I love me. This is another thing that I'm worried about is that somebody could get angry or there's like some sort of drama somehow, some way. I don't know. Maybe like somebody says something to a family member or something. I don't know. Um, it's probably not going to happen, but it's just in the back of my head. This worst case scenario. Worst case scenario for drama starting. That is awful. You ruin something that is going to be ingrained in the back of her head forever and his. You ruined your uh, And all she said was, I love you with all your flaws. Uh, yeah, none of us are perfect. Before this, did he suck on your titty too? Mama, mama, wee. Mommy's milk? Why are you still babying your son? Speaking of that, guys, besties. Oh my God, there, <laughs> there was an article that came out about how a bride caught her husband latching on to his mother's breastesis, sucking milk. Before they walked down the aisle, cause he was nervous. Huh? On that note, um, we're gonna go on to the next video. But before I do that, I'm gonna rate this one. I'm gonna rate this one a seven out of 10. No, 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 no. I'm gonna rate this an 8.5 because that's pretty... Oh God, yeah, that ruined the day. On to the next one. I still can't believe my husband did this at our wedding. You can't take one day, one day to make her happy. Do you even like her? That, that is my question to all the grooms that are going to do anything bad throughout the entirety of this video. Do you even like her? Because what's going on? Did you even want to propose? Did you even want to get married? People in the comments are gonna be like, Oh my God, Olivia, it's just a joke! It's just a joke! I don't care. I don't care, quite frankly. That one I'm gonna rate 6.5 out of 10. Because it's nothing crazy, like the rest of the day could have been good, and it's probably just a joke, but if it's not... On to the next! If so... Linda. <laughs> the person at the end, Linda. <laughs> everybody stared for a second. That's what was funny whenever I watched this the first time, I was like, why is everybody just staring at her limp body <laughs> i don't know what events led up to this happening i don't know if it was alcohol i don't know if it was you're prone to passing out or whatever maybe a medical condition i don't know i know that that can happen but oh i'm gonna rate this one a four out of ten dust yourself off babes and either drink some water eat some bread or Take your medication. All right, on to the next. I hope nothing more than for this video to be satire. Why is your ex-wife showing up to your wedding? I don't know what terms you guys are on. I don't know. But me personally, I'm not inviting any ex, let alone an ex-wife. And did the bride know that she was coming? Because it looks like she does it. She looks pissed. I would be marching to the courthouse to get a divorce. Are you kidding? Oh my God, the cat. This is not the Nair video. I cannot have booty hole in the camera, okay? <laughs> Look at how cute my baby is. Like I was saying, I hope the bride was aware that that was happening. I mean, either way, it's bad. It's just bad. I'm gonna give that one a nine out of 10. That is awful. You don't do that. And why is he showing alligator tears? Do you love your ex? Cause that's the vibe that I'm picking up. Why don't you go back to her? Why are you crying? Why are you crying? Why are you crying? 
Why? Why? Let's move on to the next one. You guys have absolutely seen this one. You're screwed. <laughs> <laughs> Only two things are required to keep me happy, keep my belly full and my balls empty. Oh my God. <laughs> so you're amazing. Uh? Bing, 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 bing. In front of your parents, in front of your family, in front of your loved ones. Um, I love that you can get my rocks off. What? No. Raising a half of it, we really need to get you some cooking lessons. <laughs> Even when my belly isn't <laughs> full, there is no one I could ever love more in this lifetime unless I actually get a chance to meet Margot Robbie. Since the beginning, I was. I'm uh, I'm so sorry that I keep stopping the video, but no, yeah. Whenever I picture my wedding. I would love nothing more than for Ulysses, my fiance, to compare me to another woman. Yes, please tell me how much hotter Margot Robbie is than me. Yes! <laughs> oh my god. I was always told, life gets even better when the kids fall asleep and you tell me to come to the bedroom. <laughs> Nothing's better than the sound of gagging and headboard slamming. Michael. P.S. since you're no, because what do we what a chat? I what do we think that my wife is what do we gonna love this? What do we? You're so good at making decisions like Mary and me. You can choose whether tonight's gonna end with being a toaster, strudel, or a Twinkie. <laughs> <laughs> that was the entirety of his vows. Basically, like reading a Wattpad story, a poorly written Wattpad story. What? Nowhere did he say how beautiful she was, how much he loves growing with her, what they've been through in the past, how they're so excited to be moving forward. Huh? Huh? What possesses you? Uh, that's crude and just gross and not like, there's a time and a place. I don't know if there's any time at a wedding to be talking like that, it's kind of gross. Amongst each other is perfectly fine. I, I'll be making the jokes, don't even worry about it. And I'm sure Ulysses will be too, but not on a microphone in front of everybody in the ceremony, nonetheless. I wouldn't even recommend this in the reception. What, what are you token on to do something like that? You're, what? This one I'm going to give a 10 out of 10, um, just because of the obvious. It's so gross, so disgusting, and I know that she has defended him on TikTok, which, do your thing, girl, you know, whatever floats your boat, whatever you like, but for me personally, no, that's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Okay, guys, this is going to be the last video, so let's get right into it. Yeah, no. Abso- Fuck no. I would take that phone, smash it, grab his hand, and walk him right down to the divorce area center. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I don't plan on getting a divorce. I don't know what it's called. Courthouse? Walk his ass right down to the courthouse and be like, Oh, you want to be on your phone? No, no, you can be on your phone. No, absolutely you can be on your phone, but you're going to do it without me. Now you could be on your phone forever, by yourself, alone. That is so disrespectful. During the ceremony, what is with these men during the ceremony? Holy matrimony. More like holy moly. That shit was fucking ass. That one fell flat, didn't it? That one fell flat. <laughs> I'm gonna rate this one a 10 out of 10 for the absurdity of the video. I wanna give them the benefit of the doubt and say that they're not actually like this and it's just do it for the vine. Duel for Divine. That's as much as I can handle today. But yeah, I get married this October. Literally who fucking ass, bitch. Shut up. I'm so excited. I think I might do a vlog the day of the wedding. Um, but I'm going to be so busy that I might not be able to. I might just post a wedding video up here. But oh my god, I'm so excited. I have been planning like fucking crazy. Crazy. 
I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you guys want a part two in the comments below. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I will be back next weekend with another video. Comment what you want to see. Let me know. I would like to entertain you guys. That's what I'm here for. Like. Comment. Subscribe. Because if you don't, Love you. Bye.